What is up fellow chasers, Ace here back with some Vainglory All-Stars update. So 1.4 is already out my dudes, okay. And we're gonna check it out, the game, the UI, all the updates and also how to uh, update the game and download it on, um, on Android and also for those who are outside of um, GeoBeta regions, you can also... Um, stay tuned on the last part of this video. I'm gonna show you guys how to download it and yeah So for the UI, I love the background. I really love the neutral colors the neutral tones. It's more of What is it like bluish? Uh, seafoam green Seafoam green and also some uh, pastel pink It's like like here on the missions heroes like the colors are more more like vibrant but i love the neutral tone on the background on the home screen yeah i, I just love it and also for changes uh the placement of everything is different now and i'm loving it i really like it the icons are really uh are really contrasting the background so that's why it's more uh, clear and also my dudes. Uh, I just want to give you a uh, heads up There are a lot of background noises because I'm on the mountainous area right now Because <laughs> we were like as the game was updating. I was already like about to travel here and <laughs> I, I just have to record here with dudes because the update is already out and I just want to give content to you guys and yeah as you can see here the game modes are here on the right side and uh, the one is di displaying here is Minion Madness, which, uh, which we are going to play after this. And yeah, for the missions, nothing really changed. For the settings, nothing really changed. Trophy, nothing really changed. Uh, the placement of the info stats are here on top now. And also, oh my god, if you didn't uh, <laughs> see it right now, like it's on your face. There is a party system right now. You can add your friends who are online. And play with them it's here on the friends list here in the bottom on the center friends and you can search their name and add them and also here are the invites you can see the invites here from your friends and for the chest nothing really changed for the shop nothing really changed um, yeah I think that's all and also for the heroes my dudes let's scroll down and as you can see Taka is here so yeah, Taka is added here my dudes and for the like the gameplay footage that have has been released of Taka, I'm I'm so so into it but the problem is I still can't play it. <laughs> I still need to find uh, to get Taka first. And let's check out his stats. His basic attack is Assassin's Whirlwind which uh, Taka executes a flurry of brutal strikes with his arm blades. Enemies struck by this attack suffer from bleeding and continue to lose health and heal for less for a short time okay okay so basically his bleeding is mortal wounds and brutal strikes are his like basic attacks like those flurry blades like attacks and i don't know if it's a cone like on front of him or maybe it's like yeah i think it's a cone damage my dudes maybe and for his ultimate Exretsu, Taka flips backwards, okay? Then chopping nearby enemies before lunging through his target, carving an X. Taka dodges all bullets while flipping. Exretsu deals 2 times damage if the enemy is bleeding. Okay, so basically, he flips backwards. So it's a combo of his first ability and his ult. So he flips... He, oh, oh my god. If he flips backwards first which he dodges all bullets while flipping then lunges for to uh to the enemy so this is a target a target skill maybe yeah it's a targetable skill so you have to target an enemy then you flip backwards and you lunge forward <laughs> my dudes and yeah and also if you didn't know there are items now for each hero for taka he has a smoke bomb when triggered Grants the hero invisibility, a burst of speed, and a shield for a short while. This invisibility ends early if the hero takes or deals damage. So yeah, all the heroes have items now. And for her, uh, for his elemental passive ability, Dark Comfort, when this hero enters brush, they are immediately healed for 375 health, 3 second cooldown. 
Okay, so this really works well with his Dark Comfort um, Elemental Passive and also his item. So, he goes on Brush, then turns invisible. Yeah. Yeah, I think. Am I right? Yeah, so you go... You go on the brush, then you activate your item, so you'll go invisible and heal. Oh, okay, okay, that's that's a combo, I think. And yeah, that's all for Taka. But for now, let's play Catherine. Let's check uh, Catherine's item. So his uh, her item is boots. Okay, when activated, grants the hero a brief boots a boost of speed. Okay, then she's gonna be really fast then. Because her ult also gives her movement speed. <laughs> okay, okay. Let's play Minion Madness. So if you don't know Minion Madness, I think you have to pick up 10 jewels, I think. I'm not sure. But you have to like uh, get the bar full. Like you can see it later. I'm gonna play it. And also there will be minions spawning and the minions will steal jewels that are on the ground and they become stronger the more jewels they bring and deal damage. They are neutral creatures so they deal damage to both enemy and also uh, heroes, uh, ally heroes. And you have to defeat them to drop jewels and uh, if, they, if they picked up jewels they'll uh, drop them and you have to pick them up. Yeah, here's the loading uh, the loading bar here on top. Let's check if how how many. One, I think ten. I'm not sure, but I think ten. Let's use speed. Okay, I have ult. Oh no. Okay. Yeah, he's holding all the jewels, the freaking minion. Let's just stay here for a while and heal 8, nine. Yeah, I think 10 jewels. Hold 10 jewels. Seven. Okay, nine. Ten. yeah. Your victory countdown. Okay, you need to wait 15 seconds, hold the jewels for 15 seconds and you win. Let's just stay here. Uh, you still can cancel your ability somehow. That's sad. I thought they'd fi they'd actually fix it by now. You still can cancel your ability. And yeah, that's all. That's Minion Madness. And yeah, I just I like the game because it's more it's more somewhat intense than Jewel Thief. Cause I don't know, it's just a bit bland on Jewel Thief. Right now, there's Minion Madness and there's more challenge, more plays you can do. Uh, there are somewhat objectives now. And yeah, it's it's more fun. And here you can add friends. You can see the button here. You can add them. And they'll show up on your friend uh, friends list if there are not bots. Because <laughs> sometimes there are a lot of people here are bots. And yeah, that's all. And... You guys are waiting for the update because sometimes if you're outside of GU beta, you can't really update your game. You have to use a second party app. So here how you do it. Okay, you need to download Panda VPN on Play Store. It's easy. And also my dudes, if I haven't said this before, if I haven't said this on the beginning of the video, uh, it's out on iOS so stay tuned. It's not out yet, but it's going to be out on iOS soon. They'll update us, so just uh, follow on Twitter. Uh, you can join my Facebook group also. I'll update you guys there. And you can just follow the official page on Facebook also if you want. They're also on Twitter. And also, you can join uh, their Discord also. Um, yeah. And yeah, so you need to join um, addresses like New Zealand, uh, Brazil, and Australia, which are the places or regions that uh, Vingler All Stars is out so you just need to join there swipe up to connect but before that you need to go to APK Pure so my dudes how to download APK Pure if, if you don't know you just search on your browser APK Pure don't search Vainglory All Stars on the browser APK Pure my dudes okay you need to download the app first 
So go to APK Pure, uh, go to browser, search APK Pure, and download the app there, okay? After that, you need to open the app and search Vainglory All Stars. You need to complete the name, okay? Vainglory All Stars, right spacing and complete spelling because sometimes it doesn't show up if you don't do that. And if you already, so this comes for both who have the game already and also for those who don't, you need to go to groups here on the right side and go to here 1.4.0 click VG All Stars and you need to install it so after installing it both uh, both who are just here for the update and those who just download the uh, down who just downloaded the app you just install the game here immediately and after that before opening it my dudes go to Panda VPN swipe up to connect to New Zealand Brazil and um, Australia and I think you just need to watch an ad to use it for free after that you open the uh, VG All Stars you need you need Panda, Panda VPN to be on okay before opening it and if you're stuck on a screen which is just plain gray screen my dudes all you have to do is a multitask button you need to do this and click the game again and it will show up the loading okay and if you just uh, downloaded the app, you need to finish the tutorial. We do tutorial first. Finish all the tutorial first before logging in or uh, before doing anything else. Just well, uh, just complete the tut uh, tutorial first. And yeah, I think that's all it, my dudes. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope you can play the game. Um, just add me. I'll add. I'll put my IGN on my description down below. It's always there. And let's play together sometimes. And yeah, I, I think that's it for today. See you guys on the next one and have a good one, my dudes.